prison. Hello everyone and welcome back to Let's Play Risen with Tears of Gaia. Today we're heading towards the next part of the Titan Armor. And I told you last time that we're gonna go and collect this one here near Severin's place. And on my way there, I found this peculiar platform here. Where there's promise to be loot, but first... We will have to kill this thunder lizard over there. And I thought I might try to do that with my new axe. Okay. Well, I forgot that that's a stupid idea. Because they... <laughs> basically, they're turtles. So, you can't hit them with your axe. At least I think you can't. But that's what we came for. The chest over there. Yeah. And you see what's inside. The Amulet of Life. And the Illusion Scroll. Well, at least we can sell that stuff. It's not too bad. You. Okay. Now let's go to Severin's farm. Shouldn't be too far away. But I do have a speed rune. I just don't have it in my quick slots. Speed. There you go. Because, uh, yeah. I'm getting real tired of <laughs> walking uh, around this island. Uh, I think I mentioned it in one of my earlier parts that this is... Uh, that you don't really get the impression that it's just a small island but still if you if you have been playing for some time then it starts getting boring it's just you have seen it all after some time oh grave moth number one grave moth number two no mana no mana Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. At least I'm... What? Okay. Ah, <laughs> uh, maybe I can... I can't cast without okay. mana. Okay. Maybe you can drink a potion. And then levitate. Hmm. Bad idea. Well, it is a bad idea. God damn it! It's not at all what I intended to do. <sighs> Maybe that way I can get to Severin's place faster. Ah! Might as well just teleport there. What was it? The Southern Ruins, I think. Western Southern Ruins. There you go. That was the correct one. And now let's try it again. They'll be very surprised to see me coming that way. And that's what I intended to do. Surprise them. What were they called again? Fluttering Grave Moth. Bound to be a quest. Seven out of eight. One left. And that one that's left. Is the one that I will kill with my axe. Oh! Hello! Lizard people. You... <laughs> you are elite warriors, so I'm not gonna kill you with my axe. That's gonna be a little bit too hard.
Okay. Oh. And you, I need Mr. More mana. Leader. Thank you for waiting, but. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, I'm gonna need some help here. Um, is everyone dead or just that one guy? Hello, Severin. Yeah, kill him. Help me. <laughs> okay, I did it myself. Uh, you have something, Severin? I'm looking for the tombs of some Saurian high priests. I'm looking for the tombs of some Saurian high priests. Not seen anything like that. But there is one ruin near here, sealed with some sort of magical barrier. Maybe there's one of these tombs in there. But that's also where the... Wait, we're under attack. To arms. Oh, not again. Oh. Angry warriors. No man. I'm running out of mana here. And out of potions, which is bad. Don't stand him away, recruit. I'm gonna blast your way. That's another problem gone. There is one missing. There was no quest. Where? Where? Ah, there you are. Be careful. There you go. Be careful. Be careful with that magic, please. I don't want to get hurt. It looks like the race over. You're in luck. I found your crystal disc. That's perfect. The gnomes had it? You were right. The gnomes really did have a leader. You mean the Geiger really exists? Not anymore. He's dead. And I found your stolen disc on him. I'm going to have to pay more attention to campfire tales in the future. You and me both. Thanks. I hope this disc helps the Inquisitor get what he needs. Take this as thanks. And may the Holy Flame watch over us both. It looks like the raid's over, just like I was about to say. Looks like the raid's over. They'll be back. These things have been coming up like termites. You did good work. No problem. If there's anything else... Just help us do whatever is necessary to make the attack stop. Yeah, that's, that's what I'm currently doing. Okay, Reuben. You got it. The blah, blah, blah. Let's trade. Let's trade. Because I am in need of a lot of mana potions and you're gonna give me all that you have. I know the small ones, you can, you can keep those to yourself, but wine is okay too. And uh, you can have all the swords that I carry around. Rusty two-handed swords. The Titan Sword, the Traitor's Blade. You can have those. You can have this. You can basically have everything. <laughs> I have to clean up my inventory from time to time. Please uh, remember me to do this. Well, I should remember myself to do this more often. Because this is just horrible. That's what happens when you don't have a weight limit of what you can carry around, so... Okay, now we have more mana potions, and then we still have one... Derry. Hey, come out to see the pigs. Anything much happening? Anything much happening out here? We've got grave moths buzzing around everywhere. I can't let the pigs out of my sight. Grave moths eat pigs? If they're hungry enough, they'll eat anything. And pigs aren't known for being able to defend themselves. I'll deal with the grave moths. I think I did already. I'll deal with the grave moths. Thanks. I know they're dirty, but you know, these pigs have got a personality. Don't want to lose any more of them. Okay, fluttering grave moths, and I already killed one of. Uh, no, <laughs> that's not what I wanted to say. I wanted to say that I already killed most of them, 
and that there's only one left that is fluttering around over there. Oh, you saw me. Well, ah, you're gonna. Oh, you're gonna get it. Oh, you're gonna get it this time. There you go. Fluttering grave mouths quest success. So, after looting this lizard man, stripping him of his eight coins, <laughs> we're gonna go back to Derry, tell him what we did, and then finally we'll go we're gonna enter this tomb, where. I'm not really sure what we're gonna find, but it's gonna be a part of the Titan armor, and that's great. That's what we need right now, because the Grave Moths are all dead. The grave Moths are all dead. That's great. The pigs will be happy. I'm Derry, by the way. Derry, guardian of the pigs. That's me. Here, take some coins. The pigs say thank you. Thank you, pigs. For your coins and I want to go and check out this dude here Ooh, that looks nasty I'm gonna take your stuff here I just thought he was stabbed with his own stuff it just looked like that but that wasn't the case and those grave moths must be really stupid if they eat the pigs when they could have just eaten all the chicken that are roaming around here freely it's not my cup of tea. <laughs> Whatever. Okay, so this is the tomb where we want to go. I'm going to save here. Because I can already see another... No, 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 no. Let me fill up my mana. Hello. Yes, I can see the war cricket. That's what I wanted to say. Oh, a teleport stone. Plains Temple. Oh, awesome. Someone had to have this. A pickaxe. And some water. Always a great thing to have. A pickaxe, I mean. Hello, War Cricket. Yeah, these have become really easy to kill. I remember my first fight with one of those with the axe but now that I'm a mage I'm a master even and by the way I still don't like the sound of the ash beast that's waiting in here to kill me kill that scorpion here and also there's one thing I want to do I want to re-equip my quick slot to uh, the medium mana potions so that I can save the, the larger ones for when I really really need them and don't just waste them like this what was that sound okay there's nothing really here just a berry hello scorpion You can't touch me. Don't even try it. You're gonna have a bad time. He just figured that out. Should have listened to me. Instead of screaming like that. Okay, so that's where we'll have to go. And there's an elite warrior waiting. And is this gonna be a trap here? Let's save before we have to find that out the hard way. I need more mana. Oh no! There you go. That was not that hard. Combat music still going on, so I guess there's gonna be more. Oh, yes! Okay. Game over. <laughs> I feel stupid. I feel stupid because I knew it is a trap. Quick save for the win, you know. Quick save for the win. I have telekinesis, so I can just pull that lever. 
Then refill my mana. Walk over there. There's there are two more elite warriors. And what is this one doing here? There you go. Okey doke. Everything's oak. Everything's a okay. But there is an ash beast waiting. Inside there's an ash beast waiting. I'm gonna kick his ass right now. And you can watch me do it. Yeah! <laughs> no big deal. No big deal, come on. You big dummy. You thought you could take me on, but you can't. No worries, no worries. Okay. So, um, in order to get the Titan Armor thingy, I think we have to go the other way. But this here is really interesting. So, I'm just gonna levitate over there. Try to levitate as far as I can. Because uh, the jumping is just making me crazy. With those glitches and all. You know what I mean. And we have the levitation. God damn it. Ah! We have the levitation rune, so. No worries here. No shit's given, you know. Oh. There's a red one over there. What? Whoa, whoa, whoa! High priest! Trying to jump scare me! Oh no! I'm not gonna leave you alone. <laughs> but, <laughs> he did scare me a little bit. Okay, so this is a red... A red force field or whatever I think I have a scroll for this one too so we have a rune to destroy magic barrier but there is a one scroll left destroy magic force field which is the red one I'm gonna do that of course and then save but I think the high priest was the conjure skeleton oh awesome potion awesome I know what's inside of the sarcophagus potion Strong magic healing? Yes, take all of it. That potion looked like a permanent one. Traveler's potion, alrighty. And a potion of health. Good stuff. Well, that's the good stuff. I do have quite a lot of small healing potions. I didn't realize that. Let's open the sarcophagus here. And there's, of course, a skeleton warrior inside. And nothing. Ah, nothing else really. How did he hit me? That's nigh impossible. Okay. Well, I don't want to end this episode without getting to the the part where we actually wanted to go. Why is there still combat music? This is really freaking me out right now. No, it's not combat music. It's just a regular tune. Just got a little bit more dramatic. Ah, oh, I did it. I did make it. Did you see it? I risked it. Because I thought for such a small jump. I'm not gonna... Abuse... Levitation. So I didn't. And it worked out. Worked out well. There you go. Okay. Now rush to the next part so we can end this episode and don't look... So I can end this episode and don't look like a total loser because I didn't make it. Destroy a magic barrier. Poof! Be gone, my friend. Be gone. Okay, so that's where we wanted to go. That's why the pickaxe was lying in the, I could break in this the entrance. To break down this wall. And so that's the part where you realize that if you have not learned the um, the mining skill, 
You're gonna have a bad time here. That's the part where you're gonna realize that you should have. Stone plate, awesome. And there's an altar, so that makes me wonder. Whether or not I should have. Uh, but there's also. No, I can't break this down. Maybe I collected something and didn't realize it until now. Question mark? Let's. There's something here about magic. Yeah, yeah, something about magic. What could we put on the altar? A lizard bust. No? What else? From the chambers of the undead servants. Will not. No, that's wrong. That's just wrong. Okay. Seems like. The perfect. Situation. Oh, no. Oh, I want to show you this. So I turned around and realized there's something glowing up there. So we're going to use telekinesis and get the priest bust. Come here, come priest bust. Awesome. And then put it on the altar. Just like that. Just like that. There you go. Okay. That's not hard after all, you know. Unless... Unless there's a trap that's gonna kill us immediately. But no, it's n there's not. But there's an autosave. So what's gonna be inside of the sarcophagus? No skeleton! That's strange. Ooh! The titan stuff and the armor piece. Breastplate from Ursagor's armor. Oh, hell yeah. So, we have two out of five, and I did it in one episode. Which makes me really proud, because, uh... That riddle was harder than usual. I like to think so. So... This is this one. And... Yeah. Last time we got... This one, I think. So, there's still the one... Yeah, we've been there before. I remember this one. We're gonna go here next time. Um, if you remember, when I went through the waterfall and behind the waterfall, and there was the ash piece that I couldn't beat, we're gonna go back there, and I think there's gonna be some other part of the armor. That's what we're gonna do next time. Well, but that's all for today. Thank you guys for watching, you really made my day, and I hope to see you next time.